Really enjoying it. All right, and good morning. All right, I need to sleep earlier tonight. Yeah, we we're 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 kind of pushing our luck there on 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 sleeping here. I I see the. Do you see the? Yeah, see that. See his see the circles under his eyes. I like that. So, but what did that do to us? See, before it used to affect our stamina points. What does it do now? Huh. I don't see any changes anywhere on here. Did they change that? Is that no longer a thing? It could be. Uh... Where's, where, why can I, whoa, can I not rotate this? Oh, Q, rotate. There we go. There we go, plop that down there. Get rid of that out of our inventory here. All right, what do we got? Oh, Burgess. <clears throat> uh, hello, Builder. Oh, see, he's got freckles. It's so nice to see you again. Uh, as part, uh, as per the minister's instructions, I have come with a gift. Water, uh, to be more specific. Uh, the most precious gift of all. In Sandrock, Martel's Oasis is pretty much our only reliable source of natural water. Uh, we also get some water from the other city-states, but it's, it, it's expensive. So we really need to be careful and smart about how we divvy it out. Might I bring your attention to the humble little fence propped up around the, the oasis? It's the town's friendly way of saying, don't take water out of the oasis all willy-nilly, or cut down the trees for that matter. If you're short on water in your workshop, might I recommend checking the plants around your workshop for fresh morning dew, or just come down to the water tower overlooking the oasis. I'm pretty sure builder machines won't run without water in their tank. So I guess that means we'll be seeing a lot of each other in the future. Well, I won't take up any more of your time. See you at the water tower, new pal. I probably will. All right. So I've got apparently a lot of mail, I didn't realize. Important letters and subscriptions will be in your mailbox often. Okay. Uh, right. We do have a, a fireside meeting tonight. That was tonight, right? I didn't miss that, right? Was that yesterday? I'm going to feel really silly if I did. Uh, hey, Builder. Welcome to Sandrock. On behalf of my good friend, Mayor Trudy, who couldn't be available to write this letter... I'd like to extend our warmest regards from this neck of the woods. I own the Construction Junction office next to the City Hall. If you're thinking of upgrading your workshop, stop in sometime and I'll show you the ropes. I hope you're settling in all right. Thank you. Uh, hey there, newcomer. I hope you're settling in all right. I think you'll find that unlike certain conditions you'll encounter in Sandrock, the folks around here can be quite welcoming. I'd like to get to know pretty much anybody who plans on living here, and that includes you. I'm sure you have questions for me as well. I can tell you all about the way we do things around here. Uh, drop by the Blue Moon Saloon sometime for a glass of Yak Mel milk on the house. All right. Should I? Now, as long as I just do unread, I should. I can probably just keep all these, and I'll just do unread. And I can always re uh, refer to them later. All right, this is the tumbleweed standard. And then letter from Ma. Dear, dear, dear. It's hard to believe only a few days have passed since you left for Sandrock. Your father and I are already missing you so much. Even when you were small, you were always wandering away from us. Sometimes I would just let you walk and see how far you'd go, but I'd always get nervous before you did. So I guess I should have seen this coming. I'm so proud of you, and I know you're going to do great things at your new job. No one else take, uh, jumped at the chance to take that contract, because it would be tough. But you took it anyway. 
I know you'll be able to bring Telesis to Sandrock. I just wish you'd take ter better care of yourself. Those quilts I folded for you are still sitting by the door. Do you want me to mail them to you? The desert gets really cold at night, I've heard. We're so happy you're independent now, but Sandrock can be dangerous, so please don't hesitate to ask us for help. Your father's doing well. He's converting your room into a garden for his bonsai trees. I think he doesn't want to admit it, but seeing your empty room made him kind of sad. He says he'll move the trees out and let you back in any time, so I hope you're not offended. Anyway, we've sent you some money for quilts. Let us know when you're settled in, and remember to take care of yourself. <coughs> Thanks, Ma. <coughs> All right. So we got a bunch of stuff. A special backer t-shirt. Thank you very much. For those of you don't, who don't know, I was one of the first people to back this game. As soon as it came out, I was all in. So, <coughs> oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I am hoarse this morning, and all this talking is making me a little dry. Oh, fortunately, I have several bottles of water. <coughs> so, backers t-shirt. At least we have some armor now. Uh, special t-shirt for backers. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. You are always appreciated. All right, and let's. I'm just gonna gather a few materials, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go to the Commerce Guild. I'm also gonna check my calendar because I think I may have. Um, did I in fact miss that? No, today's the third. Okay, so I should get a reminder. At 1800. I should. Alright, so, buttons. Let us go and get our first job. It's time to be a builder. Oh! Uh, okay. Oh, hey, Lion. Uh, did you get a message from Jan saying emergency come now as well? Wonder what's the emergency? I didn't get a, uh, a emergency, but okay. <clears throat> Listen here, you lazy mopstick. Me and my boys have had it up to here with your excuses. Where's our lift, huh? Look, Rocky, old pal, old buddy. Don't you buddy me, pal. Since Mason's leaving, you promised me you'd do it yourself. First you said you had a cold, and then it was your turtle being sick. And today I find out you don't even have a turtle! Do you understand how much money I'm losing here? So now, I gotta give you a beatdown. Sorry, pal, but it's a company policy. Ah! Wait, no, Rocky! Look, uh, what I mean is, I was bringing new people in to take care of your uh, commission. Look, here they are! Uh, did we come at a bad time? Uh, no, no, uh, you came at the perfect time. Uh, Mr. Rocky here is the big boss of Eufaula Salvage, and he's got a very special commission that we should take care of right away. Uh, with Mason's departure, uh, the commission sort of uh, got lost in the shuffle for a few months or so, but now that you two are both registered workshops, you can take this commission off my hands. I mean, uh, uh, help out, uh, right? Oh, yeah, sure. Uh, that's what we're here for. Did you hear that, Lion? Our first big job. See? Uh, they're up for it. What do you say, buddy pal? <laughs> All right, Yan. Against my better judgment... I'm going to give you one more chance. Great! Uh, listen here, builders. Uh, Rocky and his miners are working out of Paradise Lost. You know, that big-looking ruins right next to Lion's Workshop. Uh, my pal here uh, commissioned two crane lifts to move things up and down uh, this real long tunnel they're working out of. And since there are two of you, uh, each of you uh, can make a lift. <laughs> Easy peasy for all. Sorry for putting you two on the spot. If only Jan's doing his job like he's supposed to do and 
Hey, I'm not your pal. If you're looking for parts, we have a bunch of salvage in our company backyard that you can ruffle through. It's located by the Paradise Lost Ruins. Lots of miners there. Can't miss it. Normally, we charge a weekly fee for access. But here, take one free, uh, one week free pass. Free one, whatever I mean. <clears throat> when you're done, install it for me as well. Key already drew me up a diagram for the lift, so here, you can have it. Hope you put it to better use than this sorry excuse for a builder here. Uh, my back was hurting. Based on this diagram, we won't be able to find these parts in any random scrap. I guess we'll need to take a look at Rocky's salvage yard. It looks like we need to use a furnace as well. Well, we can't finish if we don't get started. Let's do our best, Lion. I'm down with it. Hey, Rocky. So, um, does anybody else absolutely love that this guy's name is Rocky? <laughs> I want to be like, hey, yo, Adrian, how you doing? Except he doesn't quite look like Rocky Balboa. But he's like, you know, big Mr. Muscle Man, sort of like Rocky. So I, I, I'm really resisting the urge of doing like, hey, yo, Adrian. I don't want to do that. But I definitely have a gravelly voice for the fella. He kind of, he gives me that big manly husky kind of voice. You know what I'm saying? Salvagers are out busting their butts every single day. And I'm right out there with him. I oh, like that boss of yours, Yon. He just sits back in his fancy chair and waits for the profits to roll in. You know, I'm, I'm feeling you, Rocky. I'm feeling you. All right. And while we're here. Uh, okay. Grinding six grinding saws. We could totally do this. Uh, stone daggers. I don't know if I have the ability to do stone daggers. Although, we do get... Grace reputation. Uh, five days. I'm sure I can figure out how to make stone tools in five days. Right? Through no fault of my no my own, I needed a new stone daggers. Um, I need some new stone daggers. Just a grammatical thing. It would either be a new stone dagger or some new stone daggers. Just grammatic, you know, grammar. That's all I'm, all I'm saying. <clears throat> all right. And we'll go ahead and track that. Track that. Track that. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I'll do nothing of the kind. I don't suppose I can... Is Now, are they going to let me do more than one? No. Okay. So just like in the fr uh, in in my time at Porsche. Oh, hello. You have a quest thing. Okay. Oh, it's you again. Say, since I've got you, did I ever explain the commission board to you? No. How does it work? May as well go through the tutorial. Whew. Well, right, new then newbie, listen up, because I don't want to have to repeat myself. The most important commissions that I'll need you to do... Well, don't worry about that. I'll make sure you know about those. Rocky's crane lift, for example. But for everything else, there's the commission board inside the guild. Town folks post less urgent commissions there. Nevertheless, you should still pick those up right away. Good for you. Good for the guild. Each commission gets a star rating. One star means it's easy. Five stars means it's for the pros only. You want to feel the glory and reap the rewards of five star commissions? You got to start at the bottom and build up your workshop equipment and reputation. Since you're a newbie, you can only take one per day. Finish it up quick, then pick up a new commission the next day. As you raise your star rating, you'll be able to take on multiple commissions per day. Ooh, that's new, and I love that. Oh, I absolutely love that. At the end of the year, we here at the Guild count up who's been doing what around town and divvy out awards to the top performers. The rewards for taking first place are pretty sweet. 
Uh, but I wouldn't concern yourself with that so much. I mean, <laughs> I've never lost. <laughs> well, that about does it. Got everything? He said he only wanted to say it but uh, once, but... <laughs> I won't bore you, but I'm so tempted to do that. <laughs> yep, got it. That's good, newbie. You listen to speech as well. I dare say you have middle management written all over you. See you around. Yeah. So we got a lot to do. And it actually shouldn't be... It shouldn't take us terribly long to get set up. Um, I, I do want to pop in here real quick, um, and talk to Owen. It was Owen. Owen! Hello, Owen. Oh, and you have a quest for me. Hey, you're one of the, one of the new builders. Pleasure to meet your acquaintance. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. Wow. Bleh. Pleasure to meet your, mate, mate, maitre de deitre. <laughs> Pleasure to make your acquaintance. I'm Owen. I run the Blue Moon Saloon. Are you hungry? I have a couple of sample dishes. I know you can work up quite an appetite after spending a day in the ruins. Drop by any time. I'll be around. But you have a you have a quest. I want your quest. Hey there, builder. Did you get my letter? Oh, why don't we have a chat over some food and drinks? It won't take long. <laughs> sure, I like free uh, free food. <coughs> I've been meaning to catch up with you since you moved in. But I guess you and Mion have been busy with all that's been going on as of late. <laughs> as a small token of my appreciation, I'd like to offer you some food and drinks on the house. To a newcomer, Sandrock sand can be a bit overwhelming. But lucky for you, this old barkeep has been around for just a hair longer than a pan bat's age. Perhaps I can shed some light on any subjects you're still unfamiliar with. What would you like to know about? <clears throat> May as well get to uh, find out what he's got to say. Ah, the civil core here or that thin dusty line that stands between us and the many threats crawling around the Ufala Desert. But they only have two core members here, plus a cat. I'm amazed that they're able to keep up with all the security demand. Of course, Pen from the church helps out as well. And now, the one running the Civil Corps is a man called Justice. He and I go way back. He's one of the toughest guys around Sandrock these days, but back when we were kids, he was afraid of his own shadow. <laughs> oh boy, how dimes do change. He's a great guy, and his partner, Unsur, is also very reliable. If you ever run into trouble, you can surely count on them to help you out. What would you like to know about uh, Church of the Light? The Church of the Light is all about preserving the sense of community and getting rid of the dangerous Age of Corruption technology. But the interesting thing about our chapter is that Mat uh, Matilda is extremely lenient when it comes to relics and old tech. In Sandrock, we're allowed to hold on to some pretty mean stuff. Sometimes they'll even let relic weapons slide. And it's a good thing, too. Life would be that much harder out here. Ooh, excuse me. If we didn't have the means to defend ourselves. Our chapter is pretty unique in that way. Although, I've heard some chapters near the peripheries take similar stances. The church members are always proactive about helping people in and around Sandrock. Especially the old folk and the young'uns. They've gotten so organized that, as a matter of fact, they actually help handle a lot of administrative type stuff around town. We'd be up a creep, creek without them. Well, uh, you know, creeks have water, don't they? <clears throat> uh, the people in town. Oh, let's see, where to begin? Uh, we're a small town, so pretty much everybody knows everybody else. Uh, there's VV, the tailor, uh, Heidi, the architect and engineer, uh, Cooper, Mabel, and Elsie down at the ranch. Katori and her game center. Uh, Dr. Fang and his bird. Uh, there's also Arvio and Amira. Amira, that was the other one. Uh, I need to go. F I haven't met her yet. The sibling duo from Bar uh, Barnarok who moved here not that long ago. 
Uh, RVO is young, but he runs a general store pretty nicely, all things considered. Amira makes... Uh, now, I hope I'm saying it's Amira. Amira, Amira. I'm going to call her Amira. Until I know better. Amira sounds right. Amira makes ceramics that are top notch. I think she's even starting to gain some recognition for people outside of Sandrock. You can definitely tell Amira is the older sister. She's always the one covering for her brother whenever his youth gets the better of him. What's also amazing is that she never lets her skills get to her head. She's very down to earth and... Oh, uh, sorry. Maybe I'm talking too much here. <laughs> hmm. Are we thinking maybe Owen and Amira? I mean, he does seem to have a bit of a admiration for her. I don't know. Are we are we possibly shipping Owen and Amira? Maybe. I'm kind of shipping them so far. I haven't really officially met Amira yet, but really, this town is just full of nice people. If there's someone you want to get to know better, ask them to hang out. Make time out of your day to go see them. And hey, who doesn't like a nice gift now and then? I'm sure you'll have plenty of friends in no time. Uh, what about the dangers around town? Uh, yes. There is an infamous bandit around here named Logan. He used to be a citizen of our town as well. One day he just went crazy and blew up a building. I guess being out here in the desert makes some people lose their minds. Well, other than that, you have to watch out for some dangerous animals roaming around uh, the wilds, like the Jeeglers. They're mutated lizards who seem bent on causing us trouble for some reason. Oh, and how could I forget <laughs> the sandstorms? Our mayor is out in the desert right now trying to stop the winds from blowing over what little greenery we have left. You know... It wasn't always like this. A lot of people have left, and I really can't blame them. Sandrock may, might not be the best place for everybody, but there are still people who love this town, and we're all sticking around for better or worse. That's all for now. Yep, don't let me talk your ear off. Some things you've just got to experience to understand. Don't worry too much. You'll fit right in. Hey... I've been doing all this talking, and I haven't had a bite to eat yet. Maybe you should share your tales as well. Well, let me tell you. Last night, I didn't sleep well. Oh, today was nice. We gotta do this more often. In any case, let me hit you with a couple of takeaway dishes for later. Builders can't go hungry, you know. Thank you, Owen. Events photo. All right, so you do get automatic photos. That's nice. Stop in at the Blue Moon anytime you're out of energy and need a picker-upper. Don't know what to order? Get the special of the day. That's right. We've got a discount on something new every day. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to turn this into an ad spot for the saloon. I'm sure you're busy learning the ropes around here. I better get back to it. Hope to see you soon. Well, thank you very much, sir. I appreciate you. All right. And I don't see any, like, sparklies or anything like that, so let's just go ahead and go. Siren! Hello! Haven't seen you in a while. Yes, Sandrock so far is awesome. pick up that. Alright, so we've got a few things to do. I'm going to go ahead and keep picking up trash as I go. But we're, we've got some stuff to do here, so let's start working on it. Uh, first of all, yeah, water. That's a problem. So, we currently have 6% water and we need more. Because uh, the, re the recycler is using it. All right, so adjust. Can I just, can I? Hmm. Okay, yeah, because they gave me a little bit of water. Can I? Okay, so I have no more other than just what's there. All right, so I'm gonna need to get a hold of water from someplace. 
All right, and the other thing, let's come over here. We need, okay, crane lift. All right, bricks, wooden sticks, thick rope, copper sticks. And as far as I know, this is the only thing I'm gonna need for the immediate future. I know at some point we'll need a basic awning, but for now, let's stick with this. Uh, also, furnace, yes. You know what, we're gonna do a furnace first. Let's do furnace first. So, <clears throat> let's go over to stone trough. I, stone trough, stone trough, why? Oh, oh, that is stone. Gosh, I'm not, I'm used to seeing this color and seeing leather. I, I keep like looking at this and thinking, it's like, why does that look wrong? Cause it does look wrong, but it's fine. Uh, <laughs> stone daggers. Ah, okay, we need a lot of stone. Cactus spine. Really? So I am going to have to go and, and chop down a bunch of cactus. I need a recipe at the Commerce Guild store. Commerce, okay. So you know what? I probably should go back there and, and, and make that because that's one of the things picking up the slack needs. So, but any, in any case, uh, let's see, was it this one? No. Um, mission? No. Sandrock? No, not Sandrock. I mean, this, yes, all this, but... Um, no, we're still... Oh, I do, look, I do have water. Well, if I have water, why can't I use it? The chest. Is that a glitch? Confirm. What? Wait, what? Oh, you can take... Hey, Helga! How's it going? No worries, love. I appreciate you coming. Oh, that's what it is. It's because you can take water out of it and add to it. I understand. Actually, I kind of like that. Okay, I kind of like that. Um, let's let's get some let's get some stuff going here. Do I have No, I don't have anything going here. Let's We need to get kind of busy here. So let's let's look at what we got. First of all, we have quartz. That's going to be one of the things we need to, uh, to need to get. Um, we kind of need a whole lot of everything here. Maybe we should do recycler first. Wait a minute. We've got, this is the, oh, that is a recycler. But it's not letting me do anything. It's telling me I don't have the opportunity, uh, don't have anything available. Do I just not have the scrap? Maybe I just don't have the scrap. All right, um. I am gonna go ahead and keep this. Okay, we need to start collecting cactus spines, which means we gotta, uh, um, that's gonna be unpleasant. There's our rope. I'm gonna go ahead and take some food here and maybe, can I, hmm, can I not? Sort. I was gonna say, can't I, can't I do that? I can. Ruin glass. See, I do have water. Wait a minute. All right, I'm sorry guys, I'm, I'm having to remind myself of a lot of things here. Um, yeah, I just, I don't have the recipes. Right. So I, no matter what, I am going to need to go get it anyway. You know, I had, I had to just... Oh, I can kick the cactus? Oh, I can kick the cactus. Oh! Oh, and look at this. I had all this stuff that I, I also didn't... Draw, uh, I, I didn't... Hello? Pick it up. Thank you. Give me that sandworm. I didn't know you could kick the cactus. 
thank you for that. And then, yeah, I've got nothing else there. Oh, because I was going to say, how the heck am I going to? That's how. Because I've got a bunch. Hello? Can I not kick the cactus there? Kick, kick that. Okay, I can't kick it. Okay, kick, 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 kick that. All right. Kick the cactus. There we go. And, ooh. Okay, uh, I don't currently have a weapon, so we're going to hold off on that. I do not want to go trying to bust up any animals until I get me a weapon. We're just going to be gathering up. Hey, Mion. Uh, well, as long as we're here, how you doing? We'll just say hello. How's it going? Getting any commissions done? I'm trying. <laughs> have a great day. Because uh, another thing we're going to have to go do is go out and... Yeah, we got to go there. Uh, oh, hello. Copper scrap. Oh, nice. All right. Good. We need those. Can I... Okay, that that's too hard, but this is okay. Because we are going to... Uh-oh. Let's say, I am picking this up, right? Uh-oh. Okay, uh, hmm. You know what? Unlock. 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 Getting, getting backpack space is way too necessary. I don't mind spending money on that. You, you, you gotta have inventory space. That's just, that's just a fact. All right, gather up all the things. And can I, oops, can I chop? Oh, that's right, we already tried chopping you. That didn't work, did it? All right, we have more stuff. And then kick the baby. No kick the baby. There we go. All right, then we need to also get, okay, how, how much? Oh, okay, what button is it that brings up your inventory? It's, I'm trying to see where, no, add, uh, not sure. Is it T? No. No, T. Whoa. Ah, okay. So that's a, yeah. Okay, so that's, instead of T, now it's Q. Got it. Because uh, I press I, but that brings me to the album for some reason. I'm so used to that being, being this. Is it B? That's such a weird. I may change that in the uh, uh, change the 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 settings for that. All right. Give me some junk. I want all the stuff. Oh, B for bags. Okay, I guess that makes that makes a, a certain amount of sense. On the shoulders of buried giants. Ah, the data disc. That's another thing I need to do is I need to go talk to the researcher guy. And I do not remember who that is, what his name is. I'll figure it out though. And busted up. Okay, so I just got a bunch of stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. The, okay, so now that I've got all the uh, all the various scrap and such, and you know what? I'm going to go ahead and grab this as well. Because we need all the things. We are going to, first of all, go to the commission and get... Uh, go to the commission. Go to the, um, the builder guild here. I want you to do my commissions. <laughs> yeah, that's the end for you. All right, so is it here that we buy them? 
<laughs> All right, so what do we got here? Feather duster, useful. Copper gear, marble brick, copper wire, rubber tube, marble slab, bronze rivets, gunpowder, wooden storage, which we already know how to do, bronze blades, sample wooden chair, beds, thick rope. We need that one. Uh, rustic, okay. All right, so we can just buy one. There we go. And then, oh, I'm so used to, okay, so do I have to like learn it now? Right click on it or something? Sort. Did I just automatically learn it? That would be great if I did. Uh, okay, I'm not, sh it's not showing up here. See, look, water. That's got to be a glitch. That that has to be a glitch. The wooden storage is larger than the mini one. Oh, okay, good to know. Uh, so I'm not seeing a recipe book or anything, so I'm assuming that I just insta learned it. Because we we we've, we've got to have that. Actually, for that matter, I need a lot of things. Hmm. Uh, okay. Let's go and talk to that researcher guy. I'm pretty certain I know where he is. Is it here? or th No, it's here. It was him, right? Oh. Oh. Rion and Danby's home. Who is Danby? Okay, so this is not the researcher's house. Who is Danby? Is, is, and for that matter, wait, who is Rion? Do they mean Mion? Because she lives at her workshop. Who is Rion? Is he... Did he move here? Where did the... You know what? Maybe I'm doing this wrong here. Maybe I need to do this. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay, so they moved him here. All right. I do learn them automatically. Okay, thank you. All right, hello, sir. Hello, Key. A new builder. Why wasn't I informed of this? A data disk. Allow me to explain. Data disks are a type of storage medium made of multiple layers of polycarbonate. While many of them don't contain anything useful, some have troves of data on how the old world built their machines and structures. Now granted, we're not yet technically proficient enough to recreate exact uh, replicas of these disks, of these relics, relics. But with the builder's help, we can get pretty close. Data disks help me create new, di uh, create diagrams for new machines, which you can construct in your assembly station. I keep a collection of diagrams, plus potential future plans with me at all times. So if you need to build something that's not in your handbook, talk to me. Bring me data disks, and I'll give you new diagrams. Simple enough. Come again when you have more data disks. Okay, and then hello. Hmm? My tie? I think it's fine. No one will notice. I'll fix it when I get time. <laughs> right, do I have a data disk I can give him? I need three data disks for a processor. Cool. And then the grinder that, yeah, yeah, okay. Civil recycler, so I'm assuming that's just an upgraded one. Civil furnace, dew collector, oh, dew collector. Ooh, that might be a biggie. 
A machine that can sort fine stones from raw stones will sometimes provide rare gems. Ooh, I like these. Oh, I like these. Oh, Key, you and I are going to become real good buddies. Just you and I sharing the blueprints together. All right. Uh, so buttons. Oh, yes. Thank you. And thank you for making that so obvious. That is very appreciated. They made that very, very obvious. I like that. Hello, Katori. Uh, City Hall can be so stubborn. Sandrock is pretty much the most central location in the free cities. You'd think we'd be able to take better advantage of that, but it's always no money, no money. Yeah, I feel you, girl. Uh, do you by chance like cactus fruit? This is pretty cool, thanks. Okay, so she doesn't like cactus fruit. All right, well, um, take take care. Have a good one. Hmm. All right, well, uh, as long as I'm waiting here for 1900, we'll go ahead and keep making friends. Keeping the peace ain't easy, especially with only two men and one cat. Say, ever considered a career in law enforcement? No, I haven't, but, you know. Hello, RVO. Oh, why are you waving? Are you trying to get my attention? <coughs> you know, before you dive into the dangerous, he uh, hazardous ruins, you should consider getting some jerky. I heard from Rocky that nothing beats diving while chewing on a jerky. You know, I can say I've, I have never heard that. So, you know, lots of great deals. Okay, so, I, and everything's half off right now. Do I need any of these things? Not really. I mean, I'm not really cooking anything right now. And that, yeah, this is the, the knot. They're calling it the concentric knot. That's interesting. All right. Oh. Clean that up. Hello, Pen. How you doing? It's chat. If you mess with me, like so many before you, you'll find out the pen is mightier than the sword. Ha ha! <laughs> You're a funny guy. Uh, also, yeah, this is the breach, which we... I can't go in here yet, right? Yeah, I didn't think so. Alright, clean that up. Hello, Unsur. Go ahead and chat with you. We're shorthanded in, uh, in the Sandrock civ Civil Corps. Then the captain showed up to help us fight the bad guys. You should also get a pet. Wow, talk about completely random. <laughs> Hi, Unsur. Nice to meet you, Mr. Captain Random here. Oh, this is called Waterworld. I love it. <laughs> All right. Uh, so, buttons. We have the... Uh, okay, so 47 for 5. So... Oh, now that's interesting. We can sell, but he has a limit. Oh. I can sell him data disks? Oh, of course, he's with the church. Oh, that makes sense. Well, you're not getting my data disks, pal. <laughs> the hell with that. Uh, So, 97, 24. Yeah, that's as much as I can get. 
Uh, you know what? Water is life. I'm gonna go ahead and buy it all. I probably that was probably dumb, but you know what? Water is life. So we're we're 100 going to get as much water as we can. What is here? Nothing. It's a big dead end. All right. It's night. Oh wait, it's 1900. Wait, wait. No, no, no. Wait. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Time passed a lot faster than I expected. <clears throat> Simmer down now, y'all. <clears throat> As many of y'all know, our resident builder, Mason, who has been a hardworking member of our community for many years, will be leaving our flock to seek, well, shall we say, greater pastures. Uh, but today's meeting is not about goodbyes. There's plenty of time for that at Mason's retirement party. No, today is a celebration of hellos. Let's give it up for our new builders, Mion and Lion. Let's give it up. I want to be like, woo, 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 <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Very excited to be starting here. I'm going to do my very best to bring Telesis to Sandrock. Lion, care to say a few words? I want to be a great builder. I want to make many friends. I want to live a carefree life. Well, I mean, let's just be honest. I want to be a great builder. Well said, builder. I couldn't have put it better myself. Everyone, let's be patient with our new builders while they learn the ropes. And builders, don't hesitate to ask any of us for help. We won't be hesitating to putting you all to work. One more time, a big sand rock welcome for all our new builders. We have some omelets, courtesy of none other than our very own Owen. Get them while they're still hot. Meeting adjourned. Oh, and remember, conserve water. Conserve water. Uh, I, I want, wait, I want, I want omelets. Give me omelets. You promised me omelets. There we go. I got it. Hello again, young one. I'm sure everyone around town is real fired up to meet you. Don't be shy. Go around and say hello. I I will. Thank you, Matilda. Uh, oh, Jensen. Hello, Jensen. We've met, but I don't think we've been properly introduced. I'm Jensen, the conductor of the Sandrock train station. Nice to have met you, or nice to have you in Sandrock. Whenever I tend firesides, trains are mentioned a bit too sparsely for my tastes. But, uh, what can you do, right? Right. I, you know, I'm right there with you, pal. We need more talk about trains. Hello, Heidi. Alright, see, I mean, she got the freckle thing going. She got the slamming boudoir. She got the pretty purple hair. I like Heidi. She's a cutie pie. I try <clears throat> I try to always make it to the fireside meetings. You should too. Who knows what kind of important details you might miss out on if you skip them too often. See, but I mean it's so hard to choose. Should I pick Heidi? Should I pick Katori? Should I pick Grace? It's so hard. They're all too damn good looking. I mean, let's just let's just call it what it is. The, the 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 people in this game are hot. They just are. They're all really good looking people. <laughs> you know, maybe it's just my perception. I'm I'm looking for trash if you're wondering what I'm doing here. There we go. But I mean, is it just me or I just everyone in this game? Well, I mean like everyone, but like almost everyone in this game is just they're just hot. <laughs> you know? Alright, I think we I think we've gone as far as we can do with this. I gotta make it back home. And yep, yep, we're we're gonna be uh we're we're, we're gonna be doing that here uh once we go to bed. Alright, uh and I want to come over here and okay, wooden stick, uh whoops, quartz and stone trough. Bam! 
Okay, so once again, sand absorption speed. I don't know what that means precisely. Q capacity, 10. Fuel consumption, negative 10. Thank you. Fuel capacity uh, of 15. Okay. Click to play. Okay, here we go. Oh, I hit the wrong button again. Uh, where is it? Where is it? I just made a furnace. Oh, it's right here. Holy cow, that does not look like a furnace. Um, oh gosh, press the right button, Lion. Uh, let's maybe do that. Okay. It's going to take me a minute to remember how to do the, d the different stuff in this game. Let's do that. All right. So here, yes, this is where we make uh, bricks and such and the copper bars and things. I remember. Okay, so let's go ahead and yeah, let's just make, ooh, do I need stone? I kind of need stone. Um, auto fill, we'll go ahead and fill that up with the dregs. I need to go over and fill the other one with the dregs too. Uh, oh gosh. Um, I don't know, you know what? Barring knowing what to make right now, let's just hold off. Autofill, let's go ahead and do that. Well, for sure we need all of this. So let's start with, let's do some wood scrap. Yes. And rubber scrap. Yes. Oh, Q's full. I can only do one at a time. Okay, but I'll bet you I can upgrade right to the civil, and I'll bet you that would improve. Yeah, uh, working capacity increase. Okay, so note to self, we need more recyclers. All right. Um, good to know. And I do... Ah, okay. Now I have access to more stuff. Gotcha. And I notice it's pulling stuff out of the chests. Thank you for that. Thin thread. I need to make a bunch of thin thread. I have enough to make one. Oh, no. Wait, is that one thin thread? Or five? Can make five. This is a little confusing, but okay. I want to go ahead and make five. Uh, because I want to start making these stone daggers. Ah, that's what it is. Okay, I gotcha. I gotcha. Okay. I made two of them. Uh, go, go away now. Thank you. Uh, this is higher speed. Because I do, I want to at least have weapons for the time being. Uh, no, time, time does not, time stops when you're working on, um, when, when you're on, uh, stuff like this. So, we don't have to worry about that. Uh, can a 5% uh, chance to deal an extra point of break damage? Ooh, cool. Cost 10% damage when facing lower level. Hmm. Kind of like this one, but, okay. See, time does not stop, uh, uh, time does not go, uh, does not progress. When you're in the when you're in the screens like this, so we're okay. We're we're okay. This for sure is is going to take a big precedent for me. Got to upgrade our tools. These two right here. So I need that. I need wooden sticks. I need copper screws. Sharpening stones. Speaking of, do I have the ability to make a sharpening stone? Ah, hats. Yes, we need we we need. Um, oh. Okay, maybe not. I thought maybe this was armor, but no, we, no, we can't make armor right now. Wood. Shoes. Okay. You know what? I may I may go back to stone, uh, stone sword and shield. I may do that. 
Uh, also, water. Okay, I don't have enough dew, so note to self on that. Why does it say? Oh, because that's it. Okay, I'm learning to I'm learning to interpret what things mean here. This is saying what this 21 here is saying that I currently have 21. That's what this. Uh, okay, not that's not how many I can make. That's how much I currently own. Gotcha. Okay, and then this is interesting. Material requirements from don't. Okay, so this is providing a lot more information than I thought it was. Gotcha. Okay, so um, now that I've done this, let me go ahead. I did it again. Uh, and where are my daggers? Here we go. This is the one. No, I want this one. We will put this one here. Uh, what? What is this? That's Sandberry. Okay. We will put... Uh, let's see. We want to replace... That. Uh, we'll just take this out. I don't want to use those. Okay. Before we go to bed, let's go here. And let's... Yeah, I'm not currently working. But let's adjust... And let's add all of the water. Gotcha. Now, if I just did that right. Okay, it's gone. So, I think I was just doing something wrong there. I think that's all that was. I just did something wrong. All right. And let's go here. And let's sort all. Yes, please. And then we will put that away. Uh, for now, we'll go ahead and put the tokens away. I, I do intend to uh, utilize those and, and, and use them as a convenient convenient excuse to, to go and see Katori. <laughs> uh, but... Okay, let's keep all the scrap on us for now. Yeah, keep all the scrap on us for now. All right, this will work for the time being. All right. All right, let's go to bed. I have raccoon eyes. I need more sleep. So let's go to bed. Thank <music> you.